It is now time to initialize the Mamatome system. Start by inserting the probe into the holster. Attach the tubing to the side of the probe from the front of the cart. Turn on the Mamatome system. Inject saline into the aperture of the probe to prime the system and ensure the vacuum is working. You are now ready to insert the Mamatome device. Remove the obturator stylet and cap from the sleeve assembly. Remove the tip protector from the biopsy needle and place on the sterile table. Make sure that the indicator on the probe thumb wheel is in the same orientation as the indicators on the targeting assembly thumb wheel. Slide the holster and probe into the sleeve and cradle until the probe thumb wheel is flush with the sleeve mount. You are now ready to take samples. Using the keypad on the holster, press the reverse button to retract the cutter from the needle sleeve. The position of the cutter is indicated on the holster by red LED lighting. Double click on the VAC or vacuum button to change modes. Then press the forward button to activate the cutter into the probe for sampling. When the sample is taken, the cutter automatically returns, placing the sample into the sample collection area where it is retrieved with MR Safe tweezers. Before taking another sample, rotate the thumb wheel in the direction desired to take additional samples during the biopsy process. You can also use the remote thumb wheel to rotate the aperture. When sufficient samples have been taken, remove the Mamatome holster and replace the tip protector. Reinsert the obturator stylet and cap assembly to close the opening in the sleeve. To deploy the marker, remove just the obturator stylet cap. Insert the marker indicator into the sleeve and deploy. Rotate the thumb wheel with the marker still inserted to the six o'clock position. This will close the aperture and assure the marker is in position. Remove the marker and replace the obturator stylet cap. 